Luke, how would something like a instantly go from being a SaaS into an AI agent? Like how would that, how, how would they go about even making that transition? Like what would that entail? That I was about to give that example. I, that is so funny. I was about to That's use funny. instantly as an example. So, so explain instantly then first. Yeah. So instantly is a cold email sending platform and they're branching out into some other stuff. You know, they have lead finder on there now. So basically it's, they're trying to create this end to end SaaS platform where you can find all of your leads on the platform. You plug the leads then into the actual, you know, email inboxes and then it sends it out to you. And then you can respond to the messages in the instantly unibox where all the messages come into. And so the reason that I believe platforms like that are going to become irrelevant if they don't start using AI agents is because a platform is going to arise where you train a vertical AI agent on your ICP to the point where it can go do the market research. It can understand your ICP. The AI agent can then pull the lead list for you without you having to manually do that. The AI agent will then pass it on to a different vertical agent that can actually use the market research and the leads to write the copy and automatically plug that copy and plug the leads into the email sequences without a human even having to touch that. A human would then go in, quality check that obviously, and then schedule it to be sent. Once it's sent, a different vertical AI agent would be housed in the Unibox and that vertical AI agent would be trained up on how to respond to the prospects that come in from those messages. And so you theoretically could run an entire cold email system with different vertical AI agents and all the human input that you'd need would be quality checking on the copy just to make sure that it looks good. I'll take it a step further to where you basically say, hey, yes, here's my ICP, here's their pain points, Here's what I want you to go. I want you to go out and find them. Then I want you to go out and find all the platforms that they're on, including their email address, their company, X, LinkedIn, Facebook, right? And set up a, a campaign that is custom specific to that ICP and to each of those individuals that that, that uh, agent, vertical agent goes out and starts learning about every single individual prospect. You have uh, my prospect, Alessandro Kutri right? That basically I learn everything about them. I learn what platforms he's on. So then it becomes beyond in instantly all of a sudden becomes irrelevant because it's like, it's just a specific email platform. That's kind of like, okay, well, that's great. But that's, it's just like a tool. It's almost like that, I, that, I pick, that, that, that pickaxe I was using example earlier. That's just like, that's just one tool, right? But now we're building this vertical AI agent that it says to the guy, Hey, go dig a tunnel. I know that there's gold in there somewhere. I don't, you know, if you find the best tools, you find, you, you find out what sand and what uh, geology rocks that you run into while doing that dig, but you do all that. I'm just telling you what I want you to do is the end product. And therefore that instantly just becomes like that pickaxe. It just becomes like a tool that either, that either the AI agent says, yes, that's going to be the best tool for me to accomplish what I'm trying to do, or no, I'm just going to find a different way to do it. 